back to my channel Buzz About Cricket. My name is Andy Buzzer and today's video is all about short pitch bowling and more importantly getting into the ball and pulling it and being aggressive and being assertive and being positive. I think a lot of players struggle with short pitch bowling for two major reasons. One, a fault in a technique and two, the fear of being hit which actually links directly to a fault in a technique. Today's video will have a few tips and a few ideas about how we can actually build that confidence and really get into the cricket ball and be dominant when the ball is short. If you're new to my channel, please press that subscribe button. Let's get going. talk about a lot to batters when we are approaching uh, the ball being short is ensuring that there is no timeline there's no rush to get across a good technique and really being in control of a pull shot I think a lot of players just jump straight into a bowling machine or a sidearm at 70 70 plus miles per hour and they struggle with the concept of getting in line with the ball so the first thing that I want you to do is simply have some underarm feeds and really focus about keeping your head nice and still and freeing up your hands. The major point when it comes to pulling is that full extension with your bottom hand and we're focusing more on the contact at this point than anything else. When your hands are free and when your head is nice and still, you're going to be able to access the ball so much, more, so much better that you're going to be getting a cleaner strike. The next step is increasing that pace but still use a tennis ball so the batter can still focus on those key fundamentals, head, hands, base. This environment isn't all about just pulling a cricket ball, it is learning the lines and the lengths of which you want to do it to. So if the ball isn't there to pull, let it go, play a different shot, still have the capability of coming forward. There's no point just sitting back and just whacking balls aimlessly. Really focus on what your body's doing and what your head and your hands are doing and where they like to be going through the ball. Start really thinking about where you're making contact with the ball. Are you extending that bottom hand out towards the ball? Are you playing it underneath your eye line? If you're able to distinguish where you're making contact and where you feel comfortable, you're gonna build confidence within your own game and that's far more important than just standing there and hitting ball after ball after ball after ball. Learn where you like to score runs, where you like to rotate and where you need to be a little bit more conservative by either getting out of the way of the short ball or simply defending it. Remember, do not rush this process. I cannot say that enough. Build your confidence and really lock down your technique when it comes to a short ball. Keep that foundation, keep that base, have a nice still head and release those hands. It is the contact you're looking for, not force. When you've gone through this process and when you've ticked all those boxes, this is the time to now increase the pace, go onto a bowling machine or a sidearm and put it all into play. Again, this isn't an example and this isn't a drill that is simply going in there smashing deliveries. You're concentrating on those key points, keeping your head nice and still, freeing your hands and ensuring you're doing that from a stable base. If you're able to keep your weight coming backwards and forwards rather than laterally going left to right, you're going to be in control of the shot and you'll get to choose whether you're keeping it down or you're going up. If you focus on your technique, if you focus on those key elements of creating a good base, having your head in line with the ball, ensuring that your contact points are clean, I guarantee you, you will improve when facing a short ball because your confidence will go through the roof. This isn't uh, an idea of how hard I can hit the ball. This isn't a concept of uh, I'm the big man because I can take on the fast bowler. Drop your ego and just allow yourself to learn the skill properly. Then when that opportunity comes, your technique will answer everything. If you've enjoyed that video, please press that like button. And like I said, if you're new to the channel, press that subscribe. Always back yourself. My name is Andy Buzzer. That was Buzz About Cricket. Catch you next time.